All right, guys, 2017 RAV4 here. I'm gonna show you really quick how to replace the rear brake pads on this. It's a pretty simple job. So you got two 14 millimeter bolts that you need to take off with this and the caliper. Uh, but what we're gonna do first is we're gonna compress the piston. Um, I got my jack, jack stand, I got my jack here. We're gonna do is we're gonna put our flat screwdriver here in between the brake pads and the rotor so we're just gonna try to catch it and then we're gonna compress the piston back Okay, once you got it compressed, go ahead and remove the two 14 millimeter bolts here. Obviously, I can't do it with one hand, so. Oh, I'll show you how to do it. Go ahead and take these two off. This one. Take this one out. Okay, this one is still fairly okay, but we're gonna go ahead and replace it. So what you wanna do, it didn't come with the new hardware, These are the new brake pads from the Toyota. So we're just gonna clean this hardware out and then we're gonna put grease all over it. All right, so I got the hardware cleaned out. I put some grease here, here, same on the other side. Make sure that these bolts slide in and out freely. If they don't, you need to take it off and put grease inside. So we're gonna put the new brake pads. It goes in like this. Back one goes like this. Make sure it's in there tight. And then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna apply some brake pads, uh, brake grease. It came with the, the new brake pads. I'm just gonna apply some here. And then same on the other side. Then we're gonna put our new caliper, not new, but we're gonna put our caliper back on. Go ahead and put these two bolts in there. All right, so I got my two 14 millimeter bolts back on. Make sure they're tight. Spray some brake cleaner in this rotor so we don't have any brake dust in that get your wheel back on same on the other side uh, before you take it for a test drive pump the brake pedal about four or five times so it gets hard before you crank up the car and check your brake fluid reservoir make sure you got enough brake fluid in the reservoir that's it hope this video helped you if you got any questions comment below click on the subscribe button thanks for watching